everyone, welcome to the learning journey and here I'm going to share something exciting in the series. And I am going to share the story of a guy who made a higher profit making investment after figuring out the difference between simple interest and compound interest. Meet Eric. Eric is very happy today because this year he has made a profit of $5,000. Eric's friend Olivia came to congratulate him. Hey Eric, congratulations! Now you can make a good investment plan. Thanks a lot Olivia. I was also thinking about the same. But I was a little confused between two companies, UBI and SPP. Actually, the rate of interest offered by both the companies is 5%. But on $5,000, UBI is offering a simple interest and SPP is offering a compound interest. Hey Olivia, you are good at math. Can you explain me the difference between simple interest and compound interest? Yes, I am happy to help. Eric, in the first year of investing $5,000 at 5% interest rate, you will get a return of $250 as simple interest. And in case of compound interest also, you'll get the same return in the first year. However, in the second year, the total simple interest for two years will be $500. But when the same amount is compounded annually, at the same interest rate, you get a return of $512.50. Eric, the difference is due to principal amount. In case of simple interest, principal amount remained $5,000 in both the years. In case of compound interest, the principal amount for the first year was $5,000, but for the second year it was $5,250. That means, in the second year you gained the compound interest on not only $5,000, but on the $250 interest of the previous year also. That's amazing, Olivia! Now I have a logical reason to choose compound interest because apart from the initial amount, I'll get the return on the interest of proceeding here also. So guys, are you happy to figure out the difference between simple interest and compound interest? I'd love to get your feedback. Happy learning journey!